The Wirebelt Company has been based in Sittingbourne for all of its life. Indeed, next year is our 50th anniversary. The products that we make are based on the original conveyor belting and we've added to that range over the years. We've also added a range of specialist conveyors. The Wire Belt Company has had a long-term policy in terms of environmental sustainability. We had monitored the progression of photovoltaic electricity generation over a number of years, and it is only over the last year or so that we felt that we could get a satisfactory return for our investment. We teamed up with an accredited installer, Rio May, and they helped us all the way through from the initial planning of the project through to completion. PV systems are relatively easy to understand. The light from the sun hits a solar panel. The, the panel then creates a direct current, electricity current, that flows through to a, a box that's housed either on the roof or in the basement called an inverter. And that converts the DC current into an AC current that can then be used by the household or the business, or under the feed-in tariff scheme can be exported back into the grid for a further payment of tariff. We understand that our roof-mounted photovoltaic array is the largest in Kent and it will generate about one-third of our electricity requirement for the year. Because it is a feed-in tariff arrangement, the actual financial benefit to the company is in excess of that and it should reduce our electricity bills by one half. We wanted very much to celebrate its commissioning of its photovoltaic array. And we decided to do this in conjunction with a number of local companies who have an interest in adopting similar technology. We were able today to describe how the system works in terms of its various elements, as well as the financial return that the Wirebelt Company expects to get over the next 25 years. The Wirebelt Company received a considerable amount of support from Swale Borough Council in our application for planning permission and therefore it seemed very appropriate to invite Councillor Lewin to unveil the photovoltaic array and particularly the inverter. I've been very impressed by the approach of wire belts to uh, implementing the, the solar energy. I think it's well timed, I think it make, it's making a green statement and I think that it's looking to the future in the sense that we know that the cost of power and fuel is going to inexorably rise. Since the introduction of the feed-in tariff, businesses are now able to take some commercial decisions but that have a very positive effect on the, on the environment. So they can now invest in renewable energy systems, get a very good return for that investment, but at the same time have a big difference on the environment. Our photovoltaic array has actually only been in for a few weeks and in that time we have had a wide variety of weather. We've had some very sunny weather, when the unit has produced very, very close to its maximum, but even on a dark and rainy day, we're still getting about a third of the theoretical output out of the system. I'd therefore recommend it to anybody who might need to use this type of technology to drive down their operating costs.